Remember Evo's Bluetooth antenna? With it, you can update Evo so you always have the latest features. When you receive your bot or bots, it is very important to check for updates before you complete any activities. First, charge your bot or bots. They must be actively charging to update. How you will update depends on whether you are a student or a teacher. Students, you can update a single bot on your computer. If you want to update your bot before you get your assignment, go to ozobot.com evo update. This can be done with a Chrome or Edge web browser on a Bluetooth enabled computer or Android tablet. Follow the on-screen instructions to update your Evo. Educators can use the Ozobot Classroom Communicator to easily update multiple bots, like a classroom kit. If you have more than 18 Evos, update 18 at a time. First, make sure all Evos are actively charging. Then, go to classroom.ozobot.com forward slash devices. Notice that when your communicator is plugged in, pair now next to multiple Evos plus classroom communicator becomes clickable. Click it and stay on this page as your communicator finds your Evos. Once all Evos are listed on your screen, click Update All. You'll know the update is successful when all bots' front LEDs are solid green. If you see some bots with red LEDs, the update was not successful. Simply click Update All again and only the bots that need to will rerun the update. Your classroom communicator is also updatable, but it will update on its own. To ensure a successful update from multiple bots, be sure you are working on a laptop or desktop computer from a Chrome or Edge browser and make sure your communicator and all bots are plugged into power. While you wait for your bots to update, don't navigate away from the page, including opening new tabs, going to a different section of the website, or allowing your computer to sleep. There you have it, everything you need to know to get started creating with Ozobot. If you have any questions, reach out to support at ozobot.com. Otherwise, we'll see you in our Getting Started videos for coding with color codes and Ozobot Blockly.